Hello and a warm welcome from the south coast of England. This is the scene here in Brighton. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Brighton and Hove Albion up against Leeds United. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Number 11, Leandro Trossard. Number 13, Pascal Gross. Number 10, Alexis McAllister. And the team selected for Brighton and Hove Albion. Well, in this shape, unless their wing-backs play further forward, there won't be any width in their attacks, which then puts a lot of pressure on the strikers to provide the goal threat. And a look at the Leeds United starting 11. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated, and it could be difficult for them. Thank you for attending today's game at the Amex Stadium. Enjoy the match. And the match begins. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? That's a nice looking ball. Well, nothing wrong with the header, but it was always going that little bit off target. Under a fair bit of pressure. Mwepu. Joel Feldman. Caicedo with it. Well, the keeper should grab hold of it. Junior Firpo. Now with Koch. James. And Rodrigo has it. Harrison. Well, far from the ideal pass. Cooper. Junior Firpo. Now with Koch. Harrison. The ball with Junior Firpo here. Precise ball movement. On and on he goes. And saved by the keeper. And there's the delivery. Not the best clearance. Delivering it into the box. Well, it did look dangerous for a moment, but the keeper has it now. Oh, 
And the possession lost, intercepted. Chance to do damage. Very quick thinking there. Wasteful again in possession. Koch. And Rodrigo has it. Oh, good use of the ball. And up for grabs off the keeper. And he clears it out of harm's way. Oh, I think he'll be kicking himself. Ruled offside. Well, his instinct should have told him he was offside there. He has to be more alert in the box. Welbeck. And now passing it through. He's in behind the defence here. And throwing himself up the ball. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. Over it comes. Webster. Mwepu. And Feltman with it here. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Rodrigo. A foul, but advantage played. And space for the cross. No spillage from the goalkeeper. Routine. Can they create something from here? And the keeper in position to grab hold of it. Enoch Mwepu. Shown inside. A really vital interception. Could be a chance to break here. Rodrigo. Tyler Adams. They really look after the ball when they have it. James Rodrigo still could be dangerous what a genuine opportunity but it was squandered goal kick So the whistle then, we're at the halfway stage in this match. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Mwepu Welbeck Still level here But the pressure escalating But well, he's got past his man On well, the last touch off the defender So a corner coming up Now sending it in. And caught with ease. No real threat from the cross.
Joel Feldman. Dunk on the ball. And possibilities here. Robin Koch. The ball with Junior Firpo here. Can they find a gap in the defence? Well, they couldn't keep that sequence going, unfortunately. Caicedo. Welbeck. Chances on. And the keeper has denied him. Well, I've got to say, Derek, he was always in control of that situation. Brilliant stuff. And with play stop, they will make the change now. Number 10, Alexis McAllister, to be replaced by number 9, Neil Morpé. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, no end product. And into the last 30 minutes now. Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? And a yellow card for that, Stuart. And he's going to have to be careful now. That was a silly challenge. And the substitution will occur now. Caicedo. A real opening now. And a goal! That will do it. They've been pushing for it. And now they've been rewarded. Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. So underway again here. One nil to score. Mopé, beautifully weighted ball. Might really be able to trouble them here. And whipped into the box. But goalkeeper's ball, disappointingly for them. Well, the stats confirm it. Leeds have had the lion's share of possession, but they aren't doing enough with it. They need to pass it quicker. Play forward earlier and show more energy. Otherwise, they won't get back into this one. Is this the moment? Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Oh, and he didn't miss by very much. Yeah, he adjusted his body so well there. It's a great piece of skill, and it probably deserved a goal. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Cooper. On the ball, Mark Rocca. Sinistera. It's with Diego Llorente. Couldn't hang on to the ball. In behind for him to chase. Capable of so much better from that position.
Adams. Greenwood. Oh, he's given it away. Has eyes for goal. And just narrowly wide. Well, it's a good effort from that range, but I think the keeper had it covered. Adams, Rodrigo, well shortly we'll hear the final whistle, the home side with the lead, Stuart what have you made of this? Well it's going to be a nervy end to this game, but if they do hold on I think they've deserved their win, they've played really well and they've played some good attacking football and in general... Oh they could put it away Stuart, oh he saved it! Well excellent from the keeper, that's a really top class save. Time for a change then. Over it comes. Well clattered away. Webster. Mope. A very effective challenge put in. Mark Roca, Cooper, and Rodrigo has it. Trailing as they are, they're not likely to get too many opportunities late in this game. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Rosa. Malana. Mopey. Enoch Mwepu. Well timed tackle. And that is going to do it. The referee blows for full time. Brighton and Hove Albion have picked up maximum points. How would you sum it up? Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team and they deserve their victory. Well, we're focusing on him for a reason. Played with real authority in attack, Stuart. Yeah, he gave those defenders a difficult time. He got the all-important goal and created plenty of chances too. He certainly deserves the plaudits for his efforts today.